your local Ross. It's bright, so bright. See what they have in my local Ross. It looks uh, stacked a bit better. Still have all the statuettes, My Hero Academia. Got a nice Lego set down there. Uh, some metal machines, dino car race thing. Some Sonic. We do have some Transformers. Let's see. More dinos. Over here we do have a He-Man and Skeletor of the animated one. More My Hero Academia. Up here some Marvel Legends. All the stuff that they've had here for quite some time. Looking, looking, looking. Moving on up. They do have Yavin uh, Leia and a nice full stack of Yavin Leia's and that appears to be the only newish thing here don't see any Joes oh wait no lurking in the corner we still have some two croc masters all right I think I'm pretty sure I already have this one so not getting it but nice to see a stack of uh, Leia's all righty perusal in my local um, Ross you never know unless you look and they still ran randomly get stuff in so let's go to the next place alrighty YouTube we are back at my local trash Walmart in Sevierville Tennessee uh, going in to see what they got uh, don't forget to like comment subscribe uh, share the video it really helps the channel grow and don't forget to leave a question for uh, the next episode of toy talk any question will be answered. All right, let's see what they got. All right, I'm in the die cast action uh, Hot Wheels Matchbox section. I rarely show this section, but it's looking kind of empty. Got some Star Wars monster trucks. I got the Hot Wheels skates. Got our tech decks. I uh, got the Star Wars Hot Wheels section, Batmobiles. All right, let's get on to action figures. I'll go back to the action figure aisle in a couple of minutes. It was packed with people. Uh, they were waiting to get into the super locked Lego cabinet. And so they're waiting on people. So it was just packed with people. So we'll come back to that. Doesn't look like anything new has been added to the clearance section in my Sevierville Walmart. Just doing a quick uh, glance over, once over. Lego friends. That is kind of cool. Ghost Rider and Ghost Rider bike. Uh, Avatar set for 40. But uh, yeah, no action figures that I'm looking for. Well, let's go. All right, they do have some Transformers in. There's that cool looking cliff jumper. Nice looking bombshell Insecticon over here. They got Optimus and lots of the red boxes. So, pretty good stack. They even have super cheap ones. All right, let's move on. Let's see, we got some turtle action here. We got some turtle stuffies. More turtles down low. Classic turtles. Metroid. We got uh, one Marvel Legend over here. Let's see, we got Magneto, Magneto, Magneto. We got Bishop, Rogue, Storm. Bishop, Rogue, and Storm. All right, got some dinos. Lots of different dinos. All right. Got uh, Mongol down there. Got, uh, let's see, yeah, some multiverse. Everyone's looking for the Black Manta in this. I've never seen one of those in the wild, but I'll keep looking for you guys. See if I come across it. Looks like a page puncher Batman there. Got... Uh, Micro Galaxy Squadron, nothing we're looking for. Bad section, bad display, stuff just strewn everywhere. Looks like they do have some more uh, blind boxes down here. Oh, Series 3? 
Huh. But we're up to series four. All right, let's keep looking. Chrysanthemums, Bix, nothing we're looking for here in Star Wars Black Series. All right, got a scrap iron, got some more wrestlers. Roxanne Perez, oh, Sami Zayn, Sami Zayn, nice to see in the wild. All right, then we got the basic boys, Tommaso Ciampa. Great. Too bad it's a basic. I'd probably pick up an Elite Tomasa. All right. Back to the standard peg warmers. And that's becoming a peg warmer. Crazy. All right. Oh, let's go shopping. We're back at Gabe's. Let's see if they got anything. It's January. Here in Gabe's, these uh, Dungeons and Dragons blasters are showing up in lots of places. We've got uh, the generic Elite Ops. Bad articulation, uh, three and a half quarter or three quarter GI Joes. Let's see what we got over here. Let's see. Scrolling, scrolling. Looking for anything fun. Seven bucks for a Tiantina and her glider. Eight bucks for uh, some Mission Fleet figures. Not bad. Looks like we have a Gundam model kit down here kind of cool all right let's keep looking I'm primarily looking for action figures as you know but let's see what uh, we can find more D&D uh, &D blasters let's see Guardians of the Galaxy cute little uh, Gamora I have a Thor as well Generic robots. All right, nothing we're really looking for. I might have to get that for my boy. Charlie would look really good on a spider bike. How much are they asking for this thing here? That's pretty cool. Saturday, I'm losing my voice. Got two shows to do today. Uh, I've never found anything good at TJ Maxx, but let's go in anyway. Let's see. Yeah, I didn't find anything over here over the Christmas uh, shopping rush. Didn't seem to get anything in that I was looking for, but uh, it's after the holidays. Let's see if they've got anything new in. It's not appearing to be so, but, uh, ooh, pizza. Tinkerbell. But, uh, yeah, nope. Nothing we're looking for here at TJ Maxx. Oh, let's get out of here. Uh, my local GameStop in Sevierville uh, rarely gets anything new in, but let's take a look anyway. Nothing new. Didn't even video much in there. Looked around. Nothing. Hey, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Really helps the channel grow. Uh, we're trying to get a 1,000 subscribers. We're getting close. Keep it up. Thanks, everybody. Uh, don't forget to leave a question for the next Toy Talk. It will be answered. So we'll see you on the next East Tennessee Toy Hunt.